Key news tonight, police have found the man they say is responsible for shooting someone at Union Station earlier this month. Channel 3's Stephanie Simone is at the breaking news desk with more. Stephanie. Erin, this press conference just wrapped up minutes ago. We are learning a lot of new details about how police were able to make this big arrest. They arrested 20-year-old Dayron Sanchez at his home last night in Derby around 9 o'clock. Police say there was a young child in the home. It all ended peacefully. Now, investigators say they tracked Sanchez's movements this past few weeks electronically they say they have the weapon they believe he used in this shooting and this was for the shooting at Union Station just a few weeks ago in New Haven where there was a fight that ended in the shooting on the platform police say MTA officers saved the victim's life he had been shot multiple times and they were the ones that started first aid rushed him to the ho rushed him to the hospital and he was recently released. They are talking with him. He is a primary witness in this. The mayor continues to stress all of these parties knew each other and this was an isolated incident. This train station is very, very active. Thousands of people coming in and out every day. And for folks on the train, I'm sure it was uh, very, very frightening. Now, this investigation shifts to the second suspect in this case. They say they know who the suspect is, they are watching him, and they say they are moving in the right direction when it comes to this second suspect. But they're, that's all they're releasing at this time. Of course, as we get more information, we will bring it to you. Stephanie Simone, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.